I'm uh, Sean Kane. I'm a PhD in psychology, and I do research on light and how it impacts our health and well being. So, I study many aspects of how light impacts human health. We now know that human beings are far more sensitive to light in general than we previously thought, and that light can disrupt our internal clocks. And when it does, it disrupts our sleep and our mood and our ability to perform optimally during the day. Circadian rhythms are 24 hour rhythms. Now, there's a real clock at the base of your brain that keeps 24 hour time. And this clock tells the rest of your body what time of day it is. And we evolved over millions of years to have strong on signals, bright days, dark nights, so our bodies know when to do the things it does. For example, we might have our hearts ready for activity during the day, but at night, that heart needs to repair itself. By knowing what time of day it is, our bodies can do the right thing at the right time. There's blue light all around us. During the day, the sun emits lots of blue light, uh, and at night, we see it in our electronic devices, on our TVs, uh, in our overhead lights. Even though light doesn't appear blue, there can be a lot of blue wavelengths in that light. Our body clocks are very sensitive to blue light. They like to get lots of light in the day and very little light at night. Because our clocks are so sensitive to blue light, uh, at night it can be quite disruptive. At night, just a little bit of blue light tells our clock it's day when it's really night. And so it becomes difficult to sleep, your depth of sleep is much more shallow, and it can impact how you function on the next day. In general, the rule should be get as much light in the day as you can and darkness at night. So optimally, you would get a lot of blue and rich light during the day. It'll help you stay awake. It'll help you be alert when you need to be alert, but avoiding blue light in the evening. This is when you should be winding down, relaxing your body, not alerting it. Getting too much blue light at night would be like having a coffee before bed and expecting to get to sleep. So the general rule, bright light in the day and dimness at night. <music>